Yesterday, while Salim was at the mall, he saw a nice pair of shoes that he wanted to buy. It costs 120 liras, but he only had 70 liras. Fortunately, these shoes were on sale, 40% discount. Could Salim buy these shoes? How much did they cost after the discount? And what does 40% really mean? In this episode, we'll explore percentages. I'm 100% sure that this is an important lesson for your everyday lives. What does the word percent mean? Let's divide it into two parts. Have you seen the term cent before? A century, for instance, is a hundred years. Cent is used to refer to a hundred. Forty percent means forty per hundred, or forty out of hundred. Before we proceed, let's watch a music video. I go out with my friends, we talk and laugh, eat and play. I go out with my friends, we talk and laugh, eat and play. We pay 70 liras on lunch and 20 liras on ice cream. I had 100 liras in my pocket. What percentage is left from the 100? What percentage is left from the 100? Imagine you have a hundred liras. You go out with your friends and spend 70 liras on lunch and 20 liras on ice cream. You spent 70 liras out of the hundred that you had on lunch and 20 on ice cream. So 70% were spent on lunch and 20% on ice cream. How much is left from the hundred? 10, 70 plus 20, plus 10 equals 100. You spent 90 liras. You spent 90% of your money and you have 10% left. 90% is a fraction, 90 out of 100. Any percentage is a fraction with 100 as the denominator. The denominator is the number below the line. So 5% means 5 out of 100. 50% means 50 out of 100, 70% means 70 out of 100, and so on. Now let's say you've collected 100 shells and you promised your sister to give her 50% of them. How much would she get? What is 50%? Let's imagine that each section in this rectangle represents 10 shells. 50 out of the 100 would be 50. And since 50 is half the 100, then 50% represents half the number. If you've collected 10 shells, what's 50% of them? 5, because 5 is half the 10. If you've collected 16 shells, how many shells would make 50% of them? In other words, what's half the 16? It's 8. 50% of 16 is 8. At the mall, Salim entered a store that had a 50% discount on all items. Can you help him calculate the final prices of these items? When an item is on 50% sale, this means we just need to pay half the price. To find half a number, we divide the number by 2. 14 divided by 2 equals 7. The final price of this scarf is 7 liras. What's the final price of the hat? After the discount, the price becomes 15 liras. 15 plus 15 equals 30. Half the 30 is 15. What about the shirt? 50% of 80 is 40. And 50% of 120 is 60 since 60 multiplied by 2 equals 120. Here are the final prices. Finding the percentage of a number is the same as finding a fraction of an amount. 
50% of 18 is the same as 50 over 100 from 18. And the word of is a mathematical symbol, which is the multiplication sign. So now I am multiplying 50 out of 100 by 18 out of 1. You can transform any number into a fraction by making the denominator of 1. Saying 18 out of 1 is just the same as saying 18. How do I multiply fractions? By simply multiplying the numerators, the numbers above the line, and then by multiplying the denominators, the numbers below the line. 50 times 18. Let's ignore the zero and multiply 18 by 5. It's 90. Add the zero, 900. Multiply the denominators, 100 times 1 equals 100. We still need to simplify the answer. The line that separates 900 and 100 can also be considered a division line. So that would be 900 divided by 100. The answer is 9. So 50% of 18 is 9. A scarf costs 18 liras. If it's on a 50% sale, you can get it for 9 liras which is half the 18. There were 90 students in fourth grade. 60% of them chose playing music as an after-school activity. How many students joined the music club? What is 60% of 90? 60% means 60 over 100, and 90 means 90 over 100. The word of represents a multiplication sign. Let's multiply those fractions. 6 times 9 equals to 54. And if we add both zeros, the answer would be 5,400. 60 times 90 equals 5,400. And 100 times 1 equals 100. Let's simplify. 5,400 divided by 100 equals 54. We just need to cancel the zeros. We are left with 54 divided by 1 equals 54. 60% of 90 is 54. 54 students joined the music club. Now is the time for a challenge. Is your thinking cap still on? Ivy earned a grade of 80% on her math quiz, 80 over 100. The quiz consisted of 30 exercises. How many exercises did Ivy answer correctly? Hmm, what exactly are we finding here? Ivy's grade was 80 over 100, which means if the quiz consisted of 100 exercises, then she solved 80 of them correctly. However, there weren't 100 questions. They were only 30. So we're finding 80% of 30. 8 over 100 multiplied by 30 over 1. What's 8 times 3? It's 24. So 80 times 30 equals to 2,400 divided by 100. We will cancel the zeros. The answer is 24. 80% of 30 exercises is 24. Ivy solved 24 questions correctly. That's why her teacher gave her an 80% grade. 24 over 30 is equal to 80 over 100. Let's now get back to the question I asked you at the beginning. While Salim was at the mall, he saw a nice pair of shoes that he wanted to buy, and they cost 120 liras, but he only had 70 liras. And fortunately, these shoes were on sale. There was a 40% discount. How much did they cost after the discount? Could Salim buy these shoes? First, let's find out how much 40% of 120 is. And then we need to deduct this amount from the original price. 40 over 100 multiplied by 120 over 1. 4 times 12, or 12 times 4, equals to 48. So 40 times 120 
is 4,800. We just add the zeros. 100 times 1 equals 100. Next, we divide 4,800 by 100 by canceling the zeros. 40% of 120 liras is 48 liras. So, listen carefully. There is a deduction of 48 liras on the shoes. The shoes did not cost 48 liras now. Let's make this deduction. Let's subtract 120, the original price, minus 48, which is the deduction, equals 72. The pair of shoes now cost 72 liras. Could Salim buy them? He only had 70. He still needs 2 liras to be able to buy them. Friends, I hope you found this lesson challenging and interesting. I'll see you next time. Goodbye. لمشاهدة المزيد من الحلقات زوروا سات سفن بلاس